Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Nicklix. So proceeding with the next lecture uh, of the JavaScript, what I am going to teach you in this video is that how to link an external JavaScript file to your current file. So right now what we are doing in the last three lectures, we are writing everything related to JavaScript in the head tag of your HTML file. What I'm going to do now is that I will create a separate JavaScript file and I will link that file to my particular this file. So let's start with the things. What I have to do here is like I have written this function show and the function add over here. I will just cut it from here. I will create a new file, a new untitled file. I will paste this all function over here. And I'm going to save it as uh, let it be some name with the file js dot js. So dot js is an extension of JavaScript file. That is a mandatory that is mandatory to write whenever you are going to save a file with a JavaScript extension like I have to click on a save now file js dot js is made so here what I have to do here is I will link this file as script type text slash JavaScript and source of that file name source file js dot js so in this way you can link a separate js file into your current file so script type javascript let's have a look open i have just opened it click me now it's working fine and here is the add function that will add two number here is like add the sum of two number is 30 so here input type button uh, all the functions are written in a separate js file so whenever I'm going to click on a button and on click show function I have called it will call it will run a show function in file js.js file because it will search for a show function in the current file when it will not found then it will check that is there any external file link to my current file so yes it was there the source file js.js was attached to my this html file it will be going in a file js.js file and it will search for a show function so there the show function exists and it will display you the output of that show function so guys in this way you can just connect your html file with your external js file so stay tuned with nicklix my channel and do subscribe and like my videos and stay tuned with me for further javascript tutorials update thanks for watching my video